And so that concludes the tour of my new place. Um, just a quick recap. Uh, the room you're currently in right now, this is where the magic happens. Um, my grandparents did set me up with this sweet place, you know, after my parents abandoned me three years ago. Um, but, I mean, it, there's a pool outside. I mean, I spend literally hours a day in that baby. So, I'm super excited to see Bev Bev because it's been like six months and since we're both away at college it's hard to see each other. But last time I tried to surprise her with a visit and that didn't work out too well. seems to be doing a lot of wonders for you. I like that color. It's, it's turquoise or something. It's really good on you. So yeah. So how have you been? I mean, is college treating you well? I'm really having a lot of fun there. I switched my major from biochemical engineering to filmmaking. What's the tell that from the whole fun that we used to have there? So what were you going for again? Um, Amish studies. <laughs> That's right. I forgot about that. Do you learn like um, churning butter or something like that? Is that... Is that what you're doing? Butter. That, that sounds exciting. That sounds like a lot of fun. I'm really glad. Yeah, no, college has been really great to me. I mean, I've had a lot of fun there, made some great friends, you know, just started, started being a lot happier and everything. So I'm glad to see Jeanette because it's been a really long time. And she gave me this, 365 ways to cook Chinese. I thought that was really nice of her to, you know, give me something. I think she's making some for lunch or dinner. So I think it'll be really good. It'll be fun. I'm excited to see what she has planned for us this time. We're crazy, wild schemes. I'm so ready for this. So ready. So I really like your new place here. I mean, it looks a lot like the old one, but it's really nice of your grandparents to help you out in that, you know, difficult time about your parent incident. But I mean, I really like, I really like what you've done with it. 
Oh yeah, it's pink walls. Yeah. I would say it's more of like a like a dusty rose, wouldn't you? Yeah. But I mean, it looks really nice in the kitchen. Do you want to show me around, like upstairs or something, and see what that's like? Uh huh. Okay. And these are my bedrooms. Oh, is that where the magic happens? <laughs> uh huh. Yeah. Yeah. Anyway. All right. And this is my bathroom. Oh. Ooh. Nice. Hey, Jeanette, I think I think the door accidentally closed and it's stuck. You're not coming out of there. But, but why? Why? Why won't why won't you let me out? Because you're not the Bev Bev I know. What are you talking about? It's me. We've, we've known each other for for ever, forever. I don't believe you. Stay. No, stop I'm struggling. Like, I'm, I'm, I'm no. I'm not one for accusations, but that girl in the bathroom is not Beverly. That's a robot or an alien or. A pirate who pirated my best friend's body. Bev Bev would nev nev act like that. Ev Ev. So my mission for today is to get the real Bev Bev back. But come on, it's me. I've known you since third grade. Can't, can't you just believe that it's me? Okay. Thank you. I just... This doesn't look like you believe me. Of course I don't believe you. I have known you for a billion years. No exaggeration. And now you come and you act like a totally different person. We haven't been friends for a billion years because we, we don't live that long, you know? But I just thought it would be fun to be, you know, happier and I thought you'd like that. I thought you'd, you'd want to do fun stuff with me. There are two things that you aren't. New and fun. So, how am I supposed to believe that this is the Bev Bev that I've known and partially liked all of these years? Well, I'm letting you call me that name I don't like. Say it. <laughs> Say it! Bev Bev. <laughs> I knew it wasn't you! But it is, I just, you know, why don't I show you? Why don't we go up to Devil's Den, you know? Won't that be fun? I mean, we're gonna, you've always wanted to go there. Uh, yes. It will be fun. Let's go. Wait, no, you need you need to untie me first. I'm, I, I, I can't get. I, let me get the knife. Oh, I think your ninja swords are over in the corner here. That'll be fun to untie me with, won't it? You know, Beverly. Thirteen Chinese children were killed right here in 1966, so Devil's Playground is not where you want to be. Beverly? Are you coming? Come on. Yeah. Long way down, huh? Yeah, it is. <laughs> Listen, I just want to tell you that I'm glad that you're taking up something new and fun Thank and exciting, you. and I just... You're my best friend. <laughs> I think I broke my arm, but Jeanette won't take me to the hospital, so this is the last time I'll ever be fun and happy ever. Say, play.